everybody welcome back to my channel this tonight we have a bath bomb demo for you this is a lush kitchen exclusive and this is the happy pill bath bomb and um, so obviously you can't get this one normally you do have to order this one on the website if you want it but it is only available in the lush kitchen so it only comes around i think i've seen it twice in the past like year so it you know comes around quite often uh, now this one here has got let's just have a little look here so it's got organic hemp oil grapefruit oil bergamot oil it's got oberon oil sicilian lemon oil orange flower absolute sicilian mandarin oil gardenia extract and uh, this one here is actually suitable for vegans as well apparently uh, so that's pretty good so it's got some synthetic color in it as well but hey ho uh yeah and it is a giant bomb i mean this is my hand look at my hand and look at the size of this bomb it is massive uh now i have seen some people like break this in half to like use it but i'm just gonna use it all in one because i'm that kind of gal and i want to see what it's gonna do in the bath um, but yeah, you could split it in two and you could have like half orange, half lemon. Um, I think that's generally the idea, but as mine's got orange all over it, I don't think it makes that much difference. Um, so yeah, let's just pop her in and see how she goes. I imagine she's probably going to sink because she's really heavy, like really, really heavy. Oh, and tonight, I just want to kind of share this with you. Uh, I have Ziggy in the bathroom with me. If you haven't met Ziggy yet... Here is Ziggy. He looks totally unimpressed. I might put in some clips of him earlier in the bathroom while I was trying to get ready to film this. He was quite funny. Uh, yeah, so let's uh, pop her in. <laughs> a lot of it it's been nearly 15 minutes now um, and there is like no sign of this thing ending anytime soon it is literally the slowest bath bomb I have ever seen where is it here it is so after 15 minutes there is like that much left of it and if I don't stop filming I'm gonna end up having a cold bath which none of us want so uh, so far pretty good um nice orange color hasn't stained the walls at all of my tub which is amazing um it's a kind of more softy 
softer scent. It's not quite as zesty and zingy um, as the Sicilian was for me. Um, it's definitely more subtle, but you can still kind of get wafts of um, like mandarin come up. It's not like that sharp orange or sharp lemon or lime. It's, it's much of a more of a, a softer orangey scent. Um, but very pretty. Um, it's kind of like that pastel peachy kind of water um, with a nice foamy feel to it. Um, with regards to the moisture content, it's not really that moisturising, I would say. I mean, it's got some moisture, but it's not like a heavy moisturised bomb. Um, so I do wonder why it needs to go on for so long. But at the same time, you know, value for money. Thumbs up! Do you like my sparkly nails today? Uh, <laughs> sorry, distracted. Anyway, um, yeah, fat little bomb. Very happy with that one. Gonna jump in my tub because it's now starting to look a bit cold. Um, and I will check you all later. Bye! Here you go, the weirdness of my cat. I'm just getting ready to film a bath bomb demo and he's come back in. I was like trying to clear up the water, like, like just clean the top of the toilet with the towel and I was gonna clean up the water here and he's come along and he's jumped up here um, and I think possibly he's pretty keen just to kind of sit here with me while we have a bath. Isn't that right, Zig? Yes? Yes, pretty boy? We haven't put anything in yet. We're gonna put this one in? Yeah? We're gonna put this one in? You ready? You ready for some bath bomb? Yeah, he's ready. Okay, so let's do this. 